All I want to say is the descending aorta, after it curves and goes down, um, it's dilated, okay? I can't say what, what Dr. Spear will recommend, but that area is large, a lot larger than it should be. <laughs> what happens when it's too large? Sometimes um, surgical intervention is needed. Okay. Okay. Um, is it constricting the blood flow? No. It's not constricting the blood flow. It could certainly cause some pain yes. at that size. Unbelievable. But it, it could also be, the pain can be due to something else as well. I need to get some information from Dr. Raybuck to see <laughs> what he's done. Um, but it no, it weakens the wall. So when it dilates and the wall is weak, it puts it at risk for rupture. Okay. Oh, okay, and the aorta rupturing is generally a dead, a devastating thing. Woohoo! Yeah, you I want, want no, I want to do that. No, no, you don't. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, it would, it, it's um, a lot of times fatal. I know. Okay, well, we don't want that. Okay, um, so Dr. Spear, we have to put the credit code. We have to put the credit code. Yes. I know. Okay. Well. I know. We'll um, we'll chat more about it now. I want to. I need to get a lot of your health history information, if that's okay. Um.